Hello, 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 everybody. Welcome back to another video. <clears throat> What's up, my beanie babies? Um, tonight, I'm going to try to make this fairly quick. I don't mean to rush, but my food getting cold. So, tonight, I have steak with onions. Um, the veggies I had last time is um, snow peas. Um, red bell peppers and roasted potatoes in this um, light buttery sauce. And then I got uh, just a regular chicken patty. I don't even know why I threw it on there. <clears throat> and then I got my huggies. Um, you know. And then I got my A1 steak sauce. A1 steak sauce is so good, y'all. So, so good. Anyway. Like I said, welcome back to my channel. Um, if you're new here, subscribe, comment down below, like, share this video. Hit that notification bell. I'm sorry, y'all. Mm. Hit that notification bell. Tap all so you don't miss any videos when I post. I'm sorry, these past couple days I would post a video one day and then not post one another day it's just it's been real hectic my daughter has had doctor's appointments and i've had appointments so it's real hectic y'all but anyway i'm gonna say grace and then i'm gonna get it in holy father in the name of jesus i thank you for this food and drink that i'm about to receive bless the hands that prepared it let it be nourishing to my body in jesus name i pray amen so how is everybody doing today right now it is nine something um over here in vegas last time uh i looked at my phone or looked at the clock on the um stove it was like 903 by the time i got done oh yeah it's, mm -mm. it's two steaks here steaks here get ready chow down chow chow it down chow it down but um how's everybody doing how's everybody doing anyway I hope everybody is having or had a marvelous, marvelous, blessed day. My day was okay. Shout out to my little brother. Um, <laughs> I don't know if y'all can hear my daughter, but she up there yelling at my sister. Shout out to my little brother who also has a channel is called um venom nasty he has a channel as well he does um gaming his birthday is today he is 25 years old you guys go check out his channel Spam up in the, in his comment section on any video. Tell him happy birthday. And tell him that Nene sent you. And then in two days, it'll be my birthday. Whoop, whoop. Mm -hmm. I don't really have anything planned for my birthday. I kind of stopped doing stuff for my birthday when it hit like 22. And it wasn't by choice. It was, you know, because something was always going on. 
and I couldn't celebrate it or I wasn't with I wasn't with people or the person I wanted to celebrate it with one time I was at the hospital and Ooh. One time I was at the hospital, not for me, I was there with somebody else because somebody else had food poisoning. But I was there at the hospital, and the only reason why I was there was because I'm the one that drove her there. She had food poisoning, and it uh, turned 12 o'clock, and it was my birthday. So I spent my time at the hospital. <laughs> and this was when I was back in Delaware. So I spent my birthday in the hospital. I was so mad. But, you know, I had to be there to support and comfort her at that time. Do I still speak to that person? Age no. <laughs> Thank God. Hallelujah. But uh, yeah. So, you know, my past few birthdays ain't been all that. Don't really, mm, don't really do anything. Nonetheless, I am blessed to see another year and this year, you know, I have a new addition, my baby girl, so I'm happy about that. Because I said, I always said I wanted to have a kid before I was 30 and God bless me with it even though you know there were some complications and stuff still you know still don't matter because my my baby girl is very she's very strong a lot of people that has been around my daughter met my daughter dealt with my daughter They all say she's a strong girl, and she is. She's very strong, and I don't just mean by like strong, strong. She she's very strong mentally, and I know she gets that from my side of the family. <laughs> Look, my side of the family. Um, shout out, <laughs> well not shout out, but, um, <laughs> I don't even know how to put this, uh, <laughs> I don't even know how to put it, I'm gonna just say shout out, shout out to my friend. I'm not going to put her name out there. She know who she is. I just got off the phone with her crazy, but she said <laughs> she's not very fond of like ASMR or mukbangs or whatever because
she feels as though it's disgusting because they're smacking, burping, licking fingers. But she smacks when she eats. <laughs> Love you, girl. <laughs> That's my girl. I've known her. Ooh. I've known her. Ooh. I've known her since she was 16. Yeah, 16. And, um, I've known her, I want to say, I've known her for nine years. Nine, <laughs> nine long years. <laughs> mm hmm Cause I met her back in um, 2010. I was dating this guy and he was friends with some sucker. And she was dating him. But we always used to hang out, riding my car on air fumes. Because I rarely ever had any gas. I'm trying to tell y'all. The Lord was on my side because I barely ever had any gas. And I was always going to her house. Always. And she lived right up the street from my house. I was over her house faithfully every day. So she's like a little sister to me. And when I say that, I mean it, because she's a pain in the butt. She got a mouth on her. But I love her nonetheless, you know. I give her advice when I can, and but She knows I'm not that kind of friend that and that'll tell you what you want. You know? I'm that kind of friend that will check you. And vice versa, you know, she has checked me a few times. You know, and I expect that. I respect that. Because if I do it to you, I expect you to do it to me. We've had our ups and downs, of course. What best friends don't. And we both hot-headed. We both got a mouth on us, so. We've clashed a few times. Woo, Jesus. I got some sauce on my box. <laughs> We've clashed a few times, but like I said, she's like a sister to me, so don't want to throw away that friendship you know because you rarely find good friendship like that especially girlfriend because I don't have a lot I'd rather not deal with female it's it's just too much you, you know females excuse me females you know we're so emotional and 
Ugh. Everybody, excuse me, got their own personality and opinion and stuff. And some females are petty. And my girl I was just talking about, she's petty as well. But I've known her for so long. That, that petty stuff don't bother me. Because I can be petty as well. You know. Nonetheless, she's a Virgo, I'm a Virgo, but her birthday is in September. Mine's is in two days. So I'm like that fresh, right at the jump, Virgo. Now, I would say some of the Virgo traits, mm, do I agree with all of them? Like, do all of them, you know, match with me? Mm, no, not really. Like they say, hmm. Virgos are a perfectionist. I am in no way, shape, or form perfect. Do I try to make things perfect? Yeah, but I've learned that it don't always turn out, you know, to be that way. Um, what else? It, um, they say we're very organized and we analyze stuff. Yes, when it comes to organized. Yeah, I like to be uh, very well planned out. I like things to be very well planned out. Um, I do like to um, plan ahead. So, for instance, if I'm going on a trip somewhere, But I'm not going until, like, later or later, like, months. Like, months later. When I first talk about it, I'll look into it. Like, flights, tickets, and stuff like that. Just so I can see how much it's going to cost me and how much I need to save and stuff like that because I ain't balling y'all I'm not I'm not balling at all but um let me move that because I feel like it's gonna drop at some point but yeah I like to plan ahead I like to um search things I'm very orient, uh, uh, very detailed oriented. Like I like to have details. I need to know when, where, how, why. You know. I need to know all that. I do overthink things, 
when I do an an overanalyze things. I am stubborn. Did I say I was very, very observant? Uh, I'm that, I, I'm, I'm very observant. Like, I'm one of them people that can be in a room full of people and can just be sitting back in the corner just watching everybody. See what's going on. perfect though. I will say that. I'm not perfect. I'm far from it. I have flaws just like everybody else. But that's what makes me me. And I love myself. Whoop whoop. I'm done, y'all. My next video, um, I'm hoping it's going to be a seafood boil. For my birthday. <laughs> so, y'all be on the lookout for that. Make sure y'all notifications is on. On, 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 on. <laughs> my veggies is gone, y'all. I'm going to tell y'all two of my favorite veggies. Broccoli. And green spinach. I first tried cream spinach from Boston Market. I was in love. Don't get me wrong, I'll you know I'll buy store brand um excuse me. I'll buy um, store brand cream spinach, but ain't nothing like Boston Market cream spinach. Ain't nothing, 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 nothing like it. It's so creamy and delicious, y'all. They put their foot in that cream spinach. <laughs> it's good, y'all. For real, for real. I don't even know why I was cutting this freaking chicken patty.
I'm gonna die, y'all. I'm gonna die. Oh, this over here is fat. I got enough of that on my body. I don't need no more. I don't need no more. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. My steak is well, well done. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right. See you guys next time. I love you all, my beanie babies. Remember to love yourself first. Stay blessed.